can see these uh, flowers were actually designed by Ignacio herself. Yes, I love them. Uh, all the flowers should be in stock. Uh, yeah, the week of tax week. Oh, I can't wait for that week, you guys. So just make sure that you're following us on. Summer. Yeah, taxes are due this year, May 17th. Thanks a lot, IRS. Thanks a lot, federal government. That's for Senate. There is a Mother's Day promo available for orders of vegan, Mom 21. Yeah, it ends Monday. Monday it ends because Monday is Mother's Day in other countries. So some moms celebrated twice, like mine. So we're going to use the diamond magic bit, pink magic bit, and we're going to remove her previous design and a little bit of that gel because her nails lasted pretty good for, what is it, four weeks almost? I know some people are like, oh my god, I can't wait till tax season. I'm like, no, further away. Away. We need more time. We need <laughs> no taxes. Or a nice flat rate, like, like Denmark. Press the number four if you dread tax season like I do. So the promo is Mom 21. Mm -hmm. And it'll take 10% off your entire purchase. And that includes pretty much everything at enocouture.com right now. And if your order is over $100 before shipping, you will still get that free bottle of gel while supplies last. You can use it until Monday. Valor in America. Own your America. Ignacio did not know where that came from and I was like, Don King used to say that and she was like, who's Don King? Yeah. We had to school her a little bit on who Don King was. I didn't know that. And then today we found out that um, Tony Catan went peace out. Our condolences to Tony Catan's family. I didn't know who she was. She was the original video vixen. Is this love? What I'm feeling? Is this the love? Please sneak in something purple for me. Uh, there is a little bit of purple on my nails. A little bit. Not too much. I did a lot of purple last time. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to switch it up. Was that Antonio? It was. They love their purple. Hi, Mary. Your prize actually shipped out today. Um, I didn't really know who White Snake was until they told me also. So. I'm sorry. Sorry, guys. Who said that? Oh. Yeah. oh. She didn't know who White Snake was? I think White Snake was British. Oh, and your order, free bottle. So we're gonna shape her phalange a little bit. A nice, you know, everyday kind of like square, not too, not too crazy square. A nice squirrely, active career, woman length. Who picks up lots of foxes? Make some um, gallina pinta. I've never made that before, but I do like to eat it. Isn't that what you made the other day? Oh, there you go. Tomatoes, tomatoes. They are different. I, actually, the restaurant that I took my mom today, you guys, was terrible. I felt so bad because none of us liked the food except my dad. But since his speech is not that great, we couldn't really. I was like, just eat more, dad. Eat more. He loved it. So you're going to order her something? A better, a better lunch. <laughs> Maybe. She wants to dress up. She's like, it's been a long time since I've gotten all fancy, but ugh, going out tomorrow, can you just imagine how many people are going to be out? I hate waiting in line. And usually when restaurants are really pre uh, packed and busy, the service is pretty cruddy. I still want to go out tomorrow, too. I feel her. Who said that? No, I do. I say that. Oh. I feel your mom wanting to get dolled up and get pretty. So we are going to push back that cuticle. Never get to go out. Who? Oh, you go out all the time. No, I do not. Yeah, you do. You go running. I didn't go running. That's giving me too much credit. I risk walked. There you go. You went out and you like going to Target. That's the same. Yes, it is. I want to go. I want to get dolled up and go to the brunch. With your husband and your kids, or would you rather go like with other people? I'd rather 
like with a girl like with all my mom friends, but I'm down to go with the husband and the kids because the husband can pay for it. <laughs> I can just I was gonna say because I would I would imagine you would want to get away from everybody. It's like today I'm not a mother, today I am queuing on or something. I'm just no one. Leave me alone. What do you guys like to do for Mother's Day? Let's clean out that cuticle and get rid of all that crusty molasses. We're going to use our famous diamond mani drill bit at a super low speed. We're going to hold our finger oops, like this and go in and clean, clean, clean. Target is nice, but it's expensive. Do you have the app, Max? What app? Target app. No, they have an app? Yeah, and you save, you save money. You get points. I get coupons all the time for the things that I buy. Really? Yeah, I save money on diapers and wipes all the time. Oh my gosh, no. But I don't shop at Target that often. You know what store I do like? 99 cents only. I love going up and down the aisles of the dollar store. So many things you can find. Not everything's a dollar there. No, that's true. But Dollar Tree is. It's like, what? What isn't a dollar here? It's like so exciting. I always feel like a big baller. I'm like, when I take my kids there. I'm like, well, I'm going to get them. I'm like, absolutely. Add to cart. Add to cart. <laughs> For Mother's Day here in Australia, going to lunch with my mom and my sister and dinner with my boys. That sounds like an awesome time. Yes. Who was that, Lucy? Since I'm alone this year, I'm going to Six Flags. That sounds like fun. Yeah. Jamie says she loves Target. Did Marissa call you? Did you call her? Lucy? Yeah. No, I didn't call her today. Did I call her today? I don't think so. I did not. I don't know what she's talking about. Um, yeah, Target has like an app and I love it because I like it knows what I buy when I scan my number or I enter my number and then it gives me coupons for the things that I buy. Wow. And they're exclusively for me. I like it. I'm not that avid of a target shopper. I do like I do like Walmart every once in a while. Do I also prefer Kmart to Target? We had a Kmart here and they closed it down like the last so one. So long ago, they had on coal. Yeah. That one has been like vacant for so long. Really? It needs to be racing there now. I see it all the time. Oh my gosh. I have not gone to a Kmart in a long time. Payless, is there still Payless around? They, 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 um, closed. All of them? Yeah. Wow. What about Factory to You? I think there's one by your side of town. No. They closed it? Uh, there there used to be a Fires Paredes. That used to be Factory to You though. I think they're owned by the same company. Uh, the fire spot that was next to nine cents only? Yeah. No, it's um, Harbor Tools or Harbor Freight or something. Freight. We have a tractor store in my side of town too, and I was like, Ooh. Oh, um, that's um, Tractor Supply. Why? Well, because, you, because Alpha Valencia, they have all those random stores. And all those horses. Really? I was like, there's a demand for a tractor store here? <laughs> yes, this is me. It is me, Lucy. Is it Lucy Frank? Yeah, she says, is that the queen, Marissa? It is me. Marissa Ignacio from the Chamorro people. I, we saw your DM right now, your message, and I was like, was that Lucy? Happy Mother's Day to Lucy! Yes, happy Mother's Day. Lucy gets to celebrate it twice. Sunday and Monday. So do I. Really? Yeah. Why? Why not? I don't know. I'm Mexican. Are you? Max. What? You met my dad. Mr. Gavino. Shout out to Mr. Gavino. He painted the outside of our warehouse. <laughs> So now we're going to use our diamond uh, prep bit. To all the Gavino girls. I was wondering if you still sign aprons if we, if we purchase one and ask you to sign it. I was watching an old video and you were saying you'd sign it if you like enough. Sure, why not? Lucy says, until Monday, double presents. Double presents for Lucy. Or double dipping. Double promo codes. I wonder what Chavali is going to do for Mother's Day. Who's that? Lucy's mom. Doesn't she live in Acapulco? She lives in Acapulco, but she is, she is the queen of Acapulco in the pink mansion. I wonder what other countries celebrate Mother's Day too. 
I know it's Women's Day in other countries too. I think in Russia, Women's Day is May 10th. Really? You guys uh, gonna have a party for your dad? You can go visit him. Oh, is it? He can come down to Tucson. He has the same schedule as me. He can come down on Sunday. She's gonna get pulled for Mother's Day. Lifted and pulled. I actually had a lift treatment yesterday. I was so worried about it too because I saw Kelly Ripa did it on her show. Yeah, like live. It was called Old Therapy or Old Therapy, something like that. No, 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 like recent. With, uh, what's his name? I don't know. Her husband? Ryan Seacrest is the host, isn't it? I don't know. I thought Kelly and Regis were. That was a show. Regis film and die. No, recently. No, a while ago. I think the host is uh, Ryan Seacrest, isn't it? I really don't care. Does anyone know? Well, Ryan Seacrest is on there with her. And, uh, she did it and she got, uh, what is it called? Laughing gas. And I was like, gosh, is it gonna hurt that bad that I have to get laughing gas? But I do pretty good with pain. And uh, I was fine. You weren't sore after? No. I came to work. But you took those Tylenols. No, I took uh, ibuprofen. It is Ryan. What? Um, it's in the top drawer. I thought I gave it back to you. If it's in, if I get it, it's in my drawer. The first one on the left, on the top. What do you guys like to do for Mother's Day? Like, if you guys like to just chill and like not have to clean and do the normal Sunday chores, or do you guys I like to go all like out? To go out somewhere. I mean, one year for Mother's Day, we had like a, in Colorado when we lived there. We did a Mother's Day like barbecue thing and we had some friends come over. What do you guys like to do? And Paul shared them stories of the tomorrow people. <laughs> Max is like, I'm going for surgery at 9 a.m. Work to 11 and party for jingles at night. That's how I roll, That's mama. So Actually, that no, was on my lunch break. And I didn't have a ride there, so I got an Uber out to the doctor's office. I caught an Uber to the doctor. The doctor, he's really nice, but like around his wife, like I don't want to say the, like the wrong thing or anything like that too, because I don't know her that well. She she was really nice. She was telling me stories about DC because we were talking about it, and uh, she told me that she used to work at uh, an HIV clinic in uh, DC, and um, her first day on the job. There was a lady there that was butt naked, waiting for her to get checked oh my God. at the clinic. And she was like, bright, okay, bright and early. Bright and early. <laughs> she walked in and she was ready. So let's use our nipper and just really gently. Jamie says she likes to chill and Mary says we all go out family and lots of And then like, if you go out, you have to wait at a restaurant. It's like, ugh. I hate waiting. I told Dominic what I wanted. I said, Dominic, I want a Reese's Peanut Butter Cup dessert that they have in the refrigerators at the Bulls Cup. We went for ice cream one day. Mm -hmm. It was like in April. Uh, this is what I want. And recently I quizzed him, you know, pop quiz. Like, hey, Dominic. Do you remember what mommy wants? <laughs> yeah, and he's like, yes, mom, I do. And I said, what is it then? And he says, it's in the fridge at the ice cream store. Aww. <laughs> he says, I get you flowers too, Mommy. Don't worry. Aww. Aww. Someone loves me. But he has, he's in this stage where he's like, You're the meanest mommy ever because I tell him to clean up his toys. Really? Doesn't Nico, Nico hit you? Nico hits me. That's funny. He thinks it's funny and like, Mom, I want milk. Can I have some milk in my cup, please? Yes, one minute, and he like throws a tantrum and starts hitting me. All the greatest food. He'll probably go to Popeyes and call it a day. <laughs> I do love Popeyes fried chicken, it's so good. Amanda likes to have a relaxing day that she doesn't need normal every day's mom thing like clean and cleaning. That is like that's exactly what I do in the hubby. Like, I don't want to clean or do laundry on my Sunday, because Sunday's not only my tour day. I want to chill, I want to eat good. 
I want to enjoy my I day. I want to enjoy my day. So we're doing our first layer of pink press-on gel. Mm -hmm. Especially with Chavalita, the queen of the party scene. Yep, Popeye's in Canada? I think they opened it up recently. I like their chicken. I like Popeye's better than I like uh, KFC. I also like some um, Church's chicken. Yes, Church is over KFC all day. But Church's is really greasy, but it's so good. So good. Gosh, I like their fried okra. Oh my god, it's so good. Like the honey biscuits. Yes, and their corn is pretty good too. You're gonna make me go to Church's after work. And I'm supposed to be on a diet, Mac. No, you need to enjoy, Ignacia. Let's bake that 30 seconds. I'll enjoy tomorrow. You're so, she's withering away. I'm mean, gonna tell the girls here, like, I'm gonna sabotage your guys' diet. I'm gonna put, like, stuff that smells like sweets in your room so that way you guys crave food. <laughs> Lucy says, yeah, Popeye's and Pan Express, but only in Edmonton, Calvary Express, like, far from me, right? She's gonna have to make a special journey. <laughs> Hi, from Chicago. Hi, from Chi Town. I love churches, says Grace. Water burger. Do you like water burger? My mom worked there for 20 years, so, like, I. We didn't eat it all the time, but like if you were really hungry, she would bring food home. Mm -hmm. And the only thing I really like from there are the chicken strips with gravy. So Is it good? It's good with the gravy, yeah. But other than that, I'm like, eh. It's a very Texan thing. I'd rather go to In-N-Out. Ugh, I hate In-N-Out. I think, I think it's so... Burger? Yeah, I think In-N-Out is so overrated. Look how beautiful the nail looks, you guys. Like, so healthy. What's the video doing, Mary? Is anybody else having issues? Tacos are like Lucy. I literally told Max everything are my favorite food is tacos or pizza. Kind of like tacos. And pizza. A pizza taco. <laughs> a taco pizza. I want to find those other tacos. Because... You should invent like a like call Pizza Hut and be like, y'all need to get up on the taco flavored pizza. Like a pizza with ground beef and salsa and pico de gallo and guac on it. Oh, Whataburger got sold to Chicago, so it's not just a Texas thing. I didn't know that. We have Whataburger here too. But I'm not a fan of Whataburger. Well, I mean, I haven't had it really in a long time. I can't remember the last time I had it. That's how long it's been. So I can't neither. I cannot confirm nor deny I like it. But I do like the tacos from Burger King. God, they're so good. The tacos from Burger King. Yes, they're that's so it. It good. So wild. Tacos from Burger King. They're, they're so really good. They're like Jack in the Box tacos. Yes, they're I, not even meat. No, I've tried them and I, I think Jack in the Box tacos are better. Really? Yeah. Have you had that their Burger King taco? Yeah, I tried it. Oh, I think they're so good. And they're so cheap too. Oh, yeah. the box tacos are now we're gonna bake this for one minute. I don't With what? Jack in the box tacos. No, 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 no. Has anybody else even had Burger King tacos? People that know what's up have Burger King tacos. Tacos from Del Taco. I don't really like Del Taco. I think Del Taco here is so gross. I've never really gone to Del Taco. I know they have tamales. Their churro was okay. From Del Taco? Taco, but I say we have churro king here. Mm -hmm. and there was <laughs> this is so good. You're like, I want to have a day where I consume 5,000 calories. Give me all the calories and then Monday I'll start. Or you can eat it and throw it up like a ballerina. That's right. So, or chew it and spit it out. That food is only good after an item of drinking at the club. You are so right, Antonio. We have a pizza place here called Fox Pizza Den. <coughs> we have a taco pizza that's delicious. And I like burger. Who said that? Um, Amanda. She knows what's up with Burger King tacos. They're so good. I'm surprised McDonald's doesn't have like a taco. So now I'm using our hand sanitizer to remove the sticky layer of uh, gel on the phalange. Did you ever take Lucy to like South Six for tacos here? Lucy, 
She knows all the taco places in Tucson and in Vegas too. Yeah, she's bringing up Vegas because Vegas is very authentic. Um, taco. Lucy should do a show like eating tacos with Lucy, Frank, around the world. That would be funny, like little snippets. Have Lucy all over the like place a eating di different tacos. She's like, hi, I'm Lucy Frank, and today on Eating Tacos with Lucy. We're gonna try tacos in Vegas. She, there's, this, there's this one taco place in Vegas that she likes a lot called Taqueria Los Tacos, and that is her spot. Yeah, that's what she said, Taqueria Los Tacos. In Las Vegas, Las Nevada. Vegas. Yeah, she said that's really the name. Taqueria Los Tacos. And there's another taco shop next to it too, but that's Lucy's, that's, that's her, her spot. spot. Do you like Bidia? Me? No. Because of the quesadillas with burger in them? Yes, it's so good. Yeah, let's go pass on that. Those are so good though. Like, delish. Mm. Or some people like um, tacos de tripa. Yes. Tripe. Yeah. Well, don't you like menudo? That's what that is. No. You you're done made it. Yeah, and? You don't eat the menudo, you're done. No. <laughs> what do you eat? On New Year's? Yeah. Chinese food. Tacos de lengua, Lucy said. Hello. Yeah, well. tongue, tongue. Tongue tacos and eyeball tacos too. They eat tacos de cabeza, head tacos. Like fish tacos or shrimp tacos? Um, sure. I can tolerate it. A little bit more lean. Yeah. Also, the cow nipple taco. What? Yeah, cow nipple tacos. I've never heard of such a thing. Yeah. That's Lucy Frank. A cow nipple taco. Uh huh. They're called tacos de seso. Where's that at? In Chihuahua. Okay. Mm hmm. Have you tasted it? No. I pass on that one. So I'm going to use the golden wombat to shape up the phalange. I I have had um, like Korean fusion food where they like make Korean food on tacos. And those are pretty good. Yeah. You know what I want in my top ball? Give me like a heart shaped like a heart, a tacos and the shape of tacos. <laughs> Like, on the bed? Yeah, on a box, like in a pizza box. Instead of of pizza, tacos. Like, tacos in a heart shape. And instead of like following rose petals, you're all following like taco condiments. Like cilantro, like, and lime. Sour cream. Ew. 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 Crema then. We don't do sour cream. Lemons. We're just gonna do pico, cilantro. Salsa. And some avocado. And... Was your mom a good cook? That means no. Well, she can make some good things. She can make good some good things, yeah. Like she worked a lot, so my dad did most of Really, Mr. Gavino? Like my mom worked later in the day, so my dad usually worked in the, in the morning. Mm -hmm. And he was home for dinner time and then my mom would be working later. Was your dad a good cook? My dad did cook. Does he like to cook or not really? Yeah, he makes a really good breakfast. Mm -hmm. And he makes a very delicious ceviche. Wow. My mom can make some really good enchilada casserole. I'm gonna have to go hit him up when I go to Phoenix next weekend. Yeah. I still don't know what I'm gonna talk about at that conference event. She likes to make um, caldo de queso. Mm-hmm. She can put potato in it. And cheese soup. Yeah. Jalapenos. Yeah, I felt so bad for her. What? I invited a, a Russian friend of mine, big shout out to Anastasia from Nail Pros Education. And uh, she went like really dressed up because it was when we were there for the show. She was all dressed up. She was wearing like this really pretty like blue sequence dress and then she showed up and it was at a taco stand. I felt so bad. <laughs> she was ready for the occasion. She thought we were going to go somewhere fancy. But it was Lucy's day to choose food, so we went to the taco stand. <laughs> but those days are long gone. No more nail, no more trade shows for me. Or maybe not this year. So we will not be at the Las Vegas Hair and Nail Show, you guys. And we will not be at Premier Orlando. Because I want to go to Florida in January. Because that is the coldest month in Florida. Let's remove that dust. And then we're going to finish out that cuticle with the diamond prep bit to make sure it is nice and blended. But look at how healthy her nails look now, too. Super low speed. There's like this little cat 
kids trap song. <laughs> the kids box. Mm -hmm. I'm healthy. That's what you said that. What? Healthy meals. I'm healthy. <laughs> I'm healthy. Oh, isn't Florida open? Yes, it is. We're technically open too. We are. Texas is pretty open. There's a few states. Nebraska. Have you ever been? No, not yet. Where are you gonna spend your birthday? Disneyland. And it's like the full circle. The place where I was born. Antonia says she's coming in January. Promise? She says, I'm coming. You gonna go to Disney World with me? Oh, for me going to Disneyland, probably. She's like, where it all started. A clean cuticle is a happy cuticle. So many notifications. That's what happens when you're famous. Oh my goodness. Go to Disney with you. I'm bringing my daughter though. She knows everything. Really? Sounds like we're gonna get along just fine then. Maybe you'll be able to take a picture with Donald this time. Because you guys have the same birthday. I don't know if they have the characters at Disneyland. How or from cool. a distance. But I don't cool. like taking pictures from a distance. I don't like how it looks. Well, like, imagine they let you take a real picture with Donald. It's like you have to be on the same birthday. I mean, like, we're at the same birthday, so. Like, come on. And they're also like pretty much in a biohazard suit too. That's what I was saying, like when you told me that they keep pictures from the business, I'm like, that makes no sense. They're in a full suit. Like it should be okay. And that's outside as well too. You're gonna cough on their face. <laughs> on their mask. When are you gonna come to Brisbane? Australia? When they open up the country <coughs> and they let people in. I would love to go back. Hmm. Well, hopefully things get back to normal for them soon. That means you guys can't do anything. Like, stuck. We're gonna trim, trim, trim. Just the excess. Toronto, it's been one and a half years since El Barrio was open. Oh my gosh. How sad she is. That is, that's a, that's a crime against humanity. Thank you! The best in the world. That must be so hard if you have small kids going to Disneyland with all the restrictions and all the new protocols that they have. Well, you can't because Mickey Mouse is like behind a barricade. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. So sad. And then the other characters that are not like in full gear, they're like the princesses. The princesses yeah. Peter Pan and stuff. I didn't see Peter Pan, but I did see the princesses, and they don't have a mask on. Yeah, they don't. They should be encouraging everybody. So now we're going to use Precious Minerals at number two, which is this really, really pretty gold glitter. And I'm going to do the fingers different. I'm going to do the accent finger, the ring finger this time. She literally stays at home and doesn't go anywhere pretty much. That's how She's too busy with her taking over the world with her uh, live streams. Her OnlyFans. She should open up an OnlyFans. Do it up your feet, Lizzie. <laughs> you can have an alter ego, they won't even know it's you. Mm-hmm, Lucia Mendez. <laughs> Different colors of gel polish on the toes. Mm hmm Or like every day just change the color. Look at this color, you guys. Isn't it? It's so sick. She's so golden. And 
then for the sticker one, we're gonna use BB37, but because it's the glitter, I wanna make sure that I get a nice even coat, so I'm just gonna give her a little shake. A little shake and bake. Lucy from the 80s, she said. <laughs> so a nice little coat of BB37. And you kinda wanna float it on, so that way you get a really nice glitter application. Because if you press on firmly when you're applying glitter polishes, you will not get any glitter. So you kind of just want to like float it on like you're frosting a cake. Like so. See? For the glitter fantasy. This is actually Mendes, Whichever one you like that day. <laughs> BB Gaitan. BB Gaitan. 30 seconds. And we're just going to freeze those colors in place. Sasha sounds like she'd be a redhead. Sasha? No, Sasha Sokol had brown hair. Sounds like a redhead. I feel bad for Sasha Sokol though. She never cut off. You guys were more than halfway there for the giveaway. Let's see if we can get to 100. We're at 60 views. Like and share. Poor Sasha. Really? She was in Timbiriche. So now we're going to do our second coat of glitter. So, get enough color and very gently apply it to the phalange with nice, even, smooth strokes. See? So that way you get a really beautiful glitter application. We didn't get to do the giveaway on IG because no. we didn't meet the requirement, the requirement for the views. Thank you. Oh, thank you. That's sweet of you. It is jumping the video. It's what? It's jumping. Really? Yeah. You must be something with uh, Facebook's end. Because the Wi Fi is working great here. Like, I'm looking at the feedback and it looks fine. Isn't this color pretty though? I really like it. It looks pretty by itself and it looks pretty as like a dollar. I really like it. I'm gonna do one more coat of this beautiful gold. This gold is Precious Minerals number two and it has real gold leafing in it and we actually have 12 colors like this too. Oh, thank you! If, if you guys are watching, since I am part of Facebook's social experiment, let's bake that 30 seconds. Last year. Um, find out if you have stars or not. And if you do have free stars, please feel free to send them. I appreciate it. That's very sweet of you. Aren't those colors classic? They're the OG Precious Minerals colors, actually. The pigmentation of this gold is so nice. <laughs> they smell so good, too. So now I'm going to do a little, very thin layer of clear press-on gel. And this is going to give me a smooth surface, so that way I can adhere the stickers to the nail, too. Because if you do them on top of glitter gel polish, since the glitter gel polish is like a metal, it doesn't feel very smooth. So this will smooth out the nail and it'll just give me a really nice uh, canvas to apply the stickers to. And also plump up the nail even more. Or you said she loves your oh, thank you. Oh, thank you! Okay, now we're gonna bake this for 60 seconds and set the dazzling darling lamp. Get a new Lux Fresh one. 
And poor Glory, she didn't come to work today, actually. So everything is where I left it yesterday. I have time to mess any of your stuff. No, poor Gloria. My condolences to her. Her husband passed away, and today she went to go um, bury his ashes. But I guess her husband was really sick, too. Uh, I'm not quite sure yet because it's uh, something very, very new. But each star is a penny. Gotta save my pennies. It's just a way for the pink army to show support, I guess. Shannon says, I want my star stream. Huh. And then also, like, I, um, the way that they're setting it up now, too, is like whoever sends the most stars or supports, they get like priority on the page. So they get like special information and things like that, That's too. That's cool. Yeah. So now we're going to remove the oxygen inhibition layer, the stickiness on the ones with BB, what is it, 37? Because these are going to be the ones with stickers on there. And then we're going to get our stickers. Let's give it a few seconds to air dry. What do you do with the stickers? Okay, we're going to be using the watercolor poppies and a few butterflies here and there. Now for the fun part, y'all. Stickers. What finger? Uh, what color fl uh, flowers on your pointer? A uh, purple. So let's do a red one on this one. Am I getting the Juan Diego sticker? <laughs> 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 What's Juan Diego? You don't know who Juan Diego is? Really? <laughs> you never heard of the story of Juan Diego? Really? When the Virgin Mary appeared in Mexico, she appeared to Juan Diego on a mountain called El Tepeyac. And she said, tell my constituents to build me a church here. And they did. Yeah, it's new. It's really, really new. Because I, I knew that like YouTube monetized their videos, but I didn't know like Insta and Facebook were jumping on that. It's very, very new, so I'm part of the social experiment. So we'll see how it goes. But it's not like, you know. Too, too uh, worrying for me because you guys know that it's all about Enochatour.com. How many of you guys have bought the watercolor poppies or um, the new stickers. new stickers? What are your favorite stickers that you guys have bought? Let us know in the comments below. I'm curious. I'm so excited. down firmly very important you guys when applying stickers is to have that silicone tool and really make sure that everything is laid flat I had her twice in one day because of the new watch so I don't know she's excited she she's ready Lucy likes number one the teddy bears oh we have more teddy bears coming too I like the cute little ones too that we just launched too. The Teddy and the Friends is adorable. Shannon says I have all the two previous sticker releases and I have to order the new one now. And if you guys use that little promo code for Mother's Day, you can save 10%. And Tony says I just bought like 20 different ones. Oh, well, I need my order. She's like, I'm ready. Tracy says I can't wait for my glow in the dark ones. I'm wearing these stickers. Oh, the glow in the dark stickers are really cool. And those are super limited edition too. That's a one time release. So we will not be launching them again. So once they're gone, they're gone. And they will slowly be making their way around the world to all of our fabulous distributors. Well, 
Home 21 USA and Canada, Lucy said. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Use that code at checkout. I think my favorite so far of the sticker line, I really like um, these ones, obviously. I like the ones. Yeah, she designed them, actually. I, I did. And then the ones, um, the ones before that you had on me, I think they were number three, the cool tone butterflies. Cool tone butterfly. And then I also really like the um, 3D butterfly one with like the roses. Oh, yeah, yeah, but that's a bigger, uh, bigger sticker. Bigger sticker. And then I like the old English and black. Number six is also really pretty. The flowers. I can't remember which one it is. Which one is number six? It's got like flowers and writing on it and then the pinky peachy flowers. What about um, Shelly Gabino's bathroom? Yes, the angel cherubs. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I should have named them. Everyone's gonna be like, why is this such a long name? Shelly Gabino's stickers, angels. And they're gonna be like, who is Shelly Gabino? Shelly's angels. Shelly's angels instead of. Charlie's Angels. So now we're going to do a thin layer of clear press on gel on top of everything. I like the rose gold old English. Those are really pretty too. Super dope. Um, the letter ones are awesome. No time to draw my shaky tequila with my shaky tequila hand. Yes. Amen to that. That's why I love our sticker so much, you guys. It really cuts down time on really elaborate designs and it just really lets you do other things too. Like add embellishments, add uh, sequins, add diamonds, whatever you want to do. You have more time to do those kinds of things. Because it's all about cutting corners. Work smarter, not harder. Because who really has time to sit there for like three hours and do their nails? Mm -hmm. I mean, realistically. Especially if you do this as a career. If you, I mean, time is money. Yeah, I mean, it's fun to be at the salon and things like that, but three or four hours on one client, that is exhausting. You need like a bathroom break and a little lunch break too. After two hours, like getting a mani pedi, I'm like, oh, this is taking too long. Oh, no, 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 put the glitter on there. We're gonna use the 2 4 Oh my goodness. Well, stop keeps going up. I'm sending me updates. Of what? His what? The ship bib or whatever. It's What's called. that? The ship or ship. It's like a like stock thing. Oh, oh! We're all getting into stock now at inovatour.com. <laughs> Thanks to Paul Ignacio. He set the trend. Do you guys do stock too? On Instagram, I asked, and they're like, we're just gonna be bad. Like, we're just trying to live. I was like, oh my gosh, sorry. My mother like, my mother in law likes the teddy bears, so I'm just gonna show her number one, and I also do little paper teddy bears. We actually just launched some new yes. teddy bears. Yes. So you should take a look at that too. Baby. They're adorable. They are really cute. I almost did those today, but I chose the water. Nobody wants them. I really wanted the water coat. Okay, number seven. What are you guys talking about? What's hiding in the corner that you want so much? Um, my mother-in-law bought flowers too when she came. Beatrice? Yeah, she got the floral ones. I think she got like number six and she got black and white butterflies. Little knickknacks. Mm -hmm. I got all the stickers in my cart. Awesome. My cookie cutters. I really like BB37. I have to get that to my collection. It's pretty hot. Do any of you guys watching have BB37 or Precious Minerals number two already in your collection? Okay, let's bake this. 30 seconds. I add to my collection here and there. Every once in a while. Yes. A little color here, a little color there. I have Precious Minerals 65, I have BB77, Gel Polish 100, and... Oh, we're going to sit with Wonder Gel. She wanted Wonder Gel. Not Precious Minerals 139. Those are all in my collection. Those are all Gavino colors. And I think Fun Gel 69. Because I love that chocolatey brown. For the toes? Mm -hmm. For everything. So now we're going to do a nice little layer of Wonder Gel. Two coats of Wonder Gel, actually. The first one's super thin. 
Tracy Ann has all of the colors that you're using on this later. Really? Yeah. She got a little, nice little... Uh, Collection. Yeah, stash right there. Do you like gold or silver? Uh, gold. Silver and gold. I'd rather have Jesus than silver and gold. Shout out to Franklin. I think it's so pretty and sparkly. They're very dainty, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Do you guys like the plumping technique? Let me know in the comments below. Okay, 30 seconds. Are you guys loving also the new Wonder Gel bottle, the electro plated one? So cute. With the little pearlized metallic ombre nude realness. I love it so much. So pretty. It's prettier than the first generation. First generation. Yeah. Which is this one. And then she got replaced by this one. Same great formula. And this is it probably is in the house. That's why the music isn't coming out with you. <laughs> Poor sis, she doesn't work on Saturdays. She has Must be nice. She has um what do you call it? Conditions. Stipulations. I wonder if this is going to want a 401k. At enocouture.com, we're going to have 401ks for our new 401k plan. 25% matching from the company. Must be nice, huh? That is awesome. You going to buy into it, Ignacio? Oh. I should get a 401k too. You should. Actually, no, I have to do it by default. What is that? You have to get one anyways? Yeah. Because we're getting one? Yes. <laughs> Real manager duties, Lizzie said. Yes. <laughs> She's so busy. She needs to uh, find herself, you know. She must be right now so hungover. <laughs> I can just imagine like one eyelash hanging off. That body. Huh? She studied makeup. You didn't know that? Yeah, but she has a big eyelash. Well, probably when she goes out. Lena told me that her, Tadeo, and Javier went out and they took a picture. I was like, oh, what did she look like? Was she all snatched? I no? I'm not friends with any of On Facebook? Really? I social media. You're friends with Tadeo, you follow him. He doesn't, he didn't post that picture of them? Oh. Oh, the brand. How exciting. But I'm not really on Facebook. And I live on my phone. My thumbs kill me, you guys. <laughs> I'm gonna get carpal tunnel in my thumbs. I think they were talking about that on a reality show once. Uh, like the thumbs, like you could really hurt yourself if you're always on your phone. Like yeah, it's no joke. And now she's done, you guys. Voila. What do you think? Max should party with his team. No, that's okay. No. I do have events for them, though. We, every once in a while, we have um, we go to the movies. team building yeah. events. And I, I did recommend that next team building. Um, event should be like at one of those escape rooms because that would be fun well actually i was thinking about something so that way um they can bring their spouses so i can meet paul really that would be funny you really want to meet him now no you met his birth giver i met beatrice which is paul's mom but i really want to uh clock matt oh. so you just meet paul there by, by default so that they just feel like you're just doing it to, do that. to clock matt <laughs> we're done yeah wow. it's a wrap she's done what do you guys think Look at that sticker encapsulation for the children. Do you guys love the plumping technique? Those stickers and these phalanges ain't going anywhere. So pretty. Let's one. Oh, you can do both. Let's see if you can move the camera around a little bit. There we go. Love your short nails. Very good for typing and packing orders, of course. Well, that's going to be a wrap for today, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little demo. I hope you guys have a fun and safe Mother's Day and don't forget that promo code MOM21. You can use it in Canada, in the US and we will see you guys in the next live video. Bye everybody!